welcome to wonderful Fine Care FIA meter operation video. First, power on and turn on the switch. Notice the switcher need to be maintained in MAC position. Use the stylus to choose standard test. Then prepare for a test. Take out a test cartridge, a buffer, and the ID chip from the reagent box. Notice, number one, the lot number of test cartridge, ID chip, and buffer must be the same. Number two, if stored in refrigerator, the buffer should be balanced at room temperature for 30 minutes before testing. Take out the cartridge from the aluminum foil bag. Select out and insert the ID chip. Tips the ID chip only need to be inserted once for tests of the same lot number. Make sure you have everything within reach before testing, such as micropipettes and their tips, timer, etc. Set the countdown time to 1 minute and start sampling. Note that the anticoagulation blood collection tube should be upside down for a few times before sampling. Use the micropipette to take 10 microliter blood sample. Remember to stay vertical to avoid bubbles which might affect the result. Discard the used tip. Mix it with buffer for 45 seconds. Remember to use the timer. Use another micropipette to add 75 milliliter mixed sample into the dwell. Keep the pipette vertical. Discard the used tip. Insert the cartridge and press test. Notice, number one, the difference between standard test and quick test is incubation inside and outside. Choose quick test if you have numerous samples that need to be tested. Number two, the reading time only takes 10 seconds the same of all tests, but incubation time for each test are different. Now we can wait patiently for the displaying of the test result. When the test is done, you can enter the patient's information before the release of the result. Press print if you need a paper copy of the result. Then take out the used test card and discard it. At last, press in, take out the ID chip and turn off the analyzer. <laughs> 